You've heard the phrase, don't judge a book by its cover. It might as well describe the man in our next story. He's a carpet cleaner by day, but it's his hobby that has people talking. Here's CBS's Steve Hartman on the road. 46-year-old Vaughn Smith of Gaithersburg, Maryland, was reluctant to even do this story. It's not something that's like, oh yeah, I'm the best. That's all it's about. In fact, most people didn't even know you had this skill. Correct. You were just the guy cleaning the carpets. I was just the guy cleaning the carpets, yeah. Although a carpet cleaner by trade, Vaughn's real gift is for words. He is what linguists call a hyperpolyglot, defined as a person who can speak at least 11 languages. As someone who took four years of French in high school and only remembers un poquito, the idea that anyone could speak 11 languages is unfathomable. But Vaughn doesn't just know 11. As the Washington Post recently verified, he is fluent in or has a basic grasp of all these languages. Spanish, Italian, Portuguese. This may take a while. I speak some Hungarian, I speak Finnish pretty well, I speak some Estonian. He also knows Welsh, Norwegian, Japanese, Hebrew, and even American Sign Language. That I had. Vaughn studies mostly with apps and books, uploading new words and phrases with almost fiber optic speed. So far, he has learned about 40 languages. Do people immediately like you more when you speak their language? Most of the time, yes. Is that part of the draw for you? Yes. Although never diagnosed, Vaughn suspects, and his mother Sandra agrees, that he is probably autistic. Oh yes, that was the problem. He had lack of participation, lack of communication. Not able to express my feelings properly or misinterpreting other people's feelings or intentions. But over the years, Vaughn has learned that when you make the effort to speak to someone in their native tongue, people are so grateful Friendships often follow. It's about being able to connect with people. It's so good. And you don't need to know any languages <laughs> to understand the importance of that. Steve Hartman, On the Road, in Gaithersburg, Maryland.